Hello there. I'm Jeremy Irons. And tonight I will be reading a special sleep story called Wonder. Before we begin, as you settle your aching body under the covers and lie your thick skull upon the pillow, let your mind drift with me for just a moment. Let us ask the question, how often do we ponder the present moment? How often do you look down upon your hands only to realize they are bathed in blood? Your crotch is wet with piss, and now you feel tears falling from your cold, vacant eyes. How many times do we fear the dark, only to find that once we enter it, we see who we really are? A boiling mass of flesh, rage, ecstasy and hunger. Tonight I hope to send you off into an extraordinary dream. Let your eyes close and your breath draw slow as I recount through the shadows of my mind this story. It was an unusually warm autumn night. Silence drowned the English manor. And yet in the periphery of my awareness, a slow, methodical, grinding rattle grows louder and louder. I believe it's coming from the cellar. This manor is centuries old. Only the stone walls remember the screams of nameless street urchins. I creak open the cellar door. And there he is, Todd, the customer service rep who failed in providing me with satisfactory internet. This man, nay, juvenile ape, is put better use as a plaything in my toy box. It is now I've come to the obvious conclusion that the rattle I heard earlier is coming from the hole in his throat, where I relieved him of the burden of speech. I feel a vibration. A light illuminates a pocket in my robe. Oh my, it looks like the internet is back online. I'm sure no thanks to Todd.